the initial part of the swap is completed, I've removed uh, the engine with the transmission from the toner car. Um, it was a really difficult job for me. Um, sorry, I, I don't know what you will miss, but you will miss something because my camera uh, lost the battery. Uh, anyway, uh, I, I can see already two issues that I will have to solve. Uh, one, um, I do not see an adapter plate, okay? So I will have to buy an adapter plate for the 2.7 uh, by turbo, okay? Um, I was not sure um, that uh, this car had, had uh, sorry, I was trying to <laughs> put this. I was not sure that if this uh, engine uh, had an adapter plate or not, and if it had, uh, which one it would be. Uh, so uh, I was kind of expecting uh, to have an issue, but I was hoping for the best. Another thing is uh, this sensor here. Um, I don't know what it is for. I'm, I'm not sure if it is from if it has to be matched to the gearbox or to the engine. Okay, because if you see here, uh, it is going uh, back into the. Uh, engine wiring room, I guess, or is it this one? Yeah, maybe it's this one. Okay. So, yeah, probably it's this one. Okay. So, probably this is uh, gearbox related, and I can keep this. Um, so, but uh, yeah, it was uh, I don't know. Um, a couple of hours a day. It was almost a week just to remove this. Uh, from the the car, so and and um, um, the Tiptronic, everybody says that is a, it's a beast. It is very heavy, um, so I'm sure it will be even harder. Uh, so I expect uh, very hard times ahead for me. Um, okay, and th this is it. Um, Please uh, subscribe um, because I will uh, I will keep posting uh, content. Okay, uh, next uh, episode I will remove the rear differential that is still uh, in the car. Okay, thank you guys. See you next time.